Is this 60 frames? I think so. Whatever. Welcome to episode 93 of the Badcast. Uh, I'm now sitting on the floor. Um, yeah, I uh, kind of forgot to make one this week. I've been kind of busy. Well, not really. I've just been really lazy, you know, enjoying the, the my time off, you know, while it lasts. So, kind of forgot to hold, make one this week, so I'm just making this real quick on the floor. Uh, I'm not even sure if I drank this beer before, so I'm going to check right now. Nope. All right. We Gucci. Um, so I've been I've been kind of busy with um, I'm I'm doing a uh, photography class uh, Cégep à distance, so it's like uh, you know like fucking I don't know what they call it in English. Uh, I'm just doing a class, but not in class, you know, like at at home. I don't know, whatever. So I'm doing a photography thingy, and it, it's pretty complicated, actually. It's kind of, it's not hard yet, but there's a lot of shit to fucking read. Uh, I got like 400-something pages to read and stuff, so. I've been doing that all week, haven't worked in a while, and I'm like so out of, out of the loop, man. I'm just like fucking shit stash going on, like greasy hair, and like I've been like living on Netflix and like fucking dying, you know, so, here's to a beer. Today we're drinking Belgueul Lager Zweier. This is a lager, uh, winter lager, basically. Something uh, to make the class go faster, you know what I'm saying? So it's kind of funny because I'm learning about photography and stuff, and I've been using this camera for uh, like what three four years almost so I kind of know a lot of it uh, but you know it, learning the basic and stuff um, so there's not gonna be I'm not gonna edit this I'm gonna try to make it short uh, no music sorry it's gonna be kind of awkward uh, I just I want to upload this ASAP so I can like get on with my shit because <laughs> I got homework to do, you know. Anyways. <sighs> Smells like a typical lager. You smell that a bit like of a wheat kind of smell, but it's not really wheat, but you know. A kind of wheat uh, smell. <laughs> also pretty dark for a lager. Lager usually are uh, a bit lighter. Uh, the color. So this um, is a 5.2% alcohol. Um, mm, 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 mm. Yeah. Um, you really taste the, like they said, it's cold hopped since, uh, you know, winter theme going on. Uh, cold hop with superior barley. You, you really taste the barley in here, and the the cold hop uh, kind of comes out. It's not too bitter, not too hoppy, but you have a nice like little taste of it in the back end, um, which makes for a pretty good lager. It's kind of a heavy lager, um, but it's good nonetheless. Um, so, as you might have seen last week, um, we had our, <coughs> uh, the, the New Year's Eve party, uh, at my house. Um, I haven't even watched the episode yet, because I'm kind of embarrassed of it a bit, to be honest. But, uh, you know, <laughs> it's pretty funny anyways, um, because we were pretty drunk not too drunk but like pretty drunk um shouts out to sb for being there thank you for chilling uh like a villain uh yeah i mean uh, that's pretty much it happy new year if uh, you haven't watched uh 
the last episode. Um, as I was saying last week, uh, my I'm just gonna say it right now, album of the year. I'm gonna say it again. If you didn't watch last week, my album of the year 2015 is Sour Soul that came in February. Came out in February. Uh, it's an album by Ghostface Killer and uh, Bad Bad Not Good. I discovered them not too long ago, like maybe a month, and uh, Bad Bad Not Good, like the, the instrumentals on, on that band are fucking insane. And the raps uh, by Ghostface are really spot on, really fits the, the kind of uh, hip hop, rap, R&B, whatever you want to call it, kind of feel I'm looking for. Uh, and, uh, yeah, it's pretty good. It's kind of short, though. It's like a 30-minute album, but it, 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 you can listen to it, like, uh, an entire, like, the, you can listen to the entire 30 minutes and, like, time has gone by so quick because it, it, it's great. Uh, my game of the year, this year, or, well, last year, 2015, is Metal Gear Solid V. Uh, I haven't finished it yet. But I'm 50 something hours in, and I've I've never played a game like that that I've been so like sucked in really quick. When it came out, like the day it came out, the week it came out, I played like fucking 40 hours of it. Like I, I was fucking addicted. I kind of fell off because uh, you know school and shit happened. Uh, but runner up and got Fallout 4. That was really great. Dying Light. Uh, which was very good. I'm very enjoying that. Uh, Dying Light getting the expansion thingy in February soon. So um, I'm really hyped for that. It's going to be cool. Um, so yeah, Fallout 4, Metal Gear Solid 5, Dying Light are my top three games of 2015. Um, I actually made a list on Giant Bomb, but I don't think it's public, so I'll have to check that out. Uh, maybe put it on my profile. Um, movie of the year, it's hard to say, uh, I saw the big short yesterday and it was fucking amazing, I really liked it, like the whole, the whole like cast, every, the acting, the, the camera work and everything on it was fucking amazing, really depressing movie if, uh, like, if you kind of like the economy kind of side of things, uh, really recommend it, you know, Star Wars was great. I don't really remember any other movie right now from 2015, so I can't really say. So I'm going to say The Big Short, because it's the last movie I saw. Well, the most recent movie I saw, so I'm going to say that. Uh, I finished watching Daredevil and Jessica Jones and Mr. Robot <laughs> in the span of like a week. So, uh, yeah, I've been doing that. Um... I've never really catched on to TV shows, like Breaking Bad was really great, but it took me two years to finish it. Uh, Jessica Jones and Daredevil, I fucking loved it really good uh, a lot, like fuck, Mwah. top notch. I can't wait for season two, Daredevil, Jessica Jones, man, Kristen Ritter, I think that's her name, she's fucking hot, I, I really like her. I mean, like, she, she's got, yeah, I like her a lot. She fine. All right. I'm, like, more obsessed about Jessica Jones than Kilgrave is. So, shouts out, Kilgrave. Uh, stay motivated, stay posy, purple man. What up? Uh, except for that, not much. Steam sales, I bought Goat Simulator. It's, um, it's uh, whatever. I, it's not really fun to be honest. I thought it was would be better, but shit happens. City of Skylines, I bought that. Really great, fucking amazing game. Um, Paint the Town Red, which I bought, which is very good too. But it's kind of empty game right now. It's it's an early access like every other game. I bought Hacknet, uh, which I haven't played much, but uh, it, it's kind of cool. You know, it's a hacking kind of game, like. Uh, the other ones, all the other fucking hacking games. Um, except for that, that's, I think, all I bought. 
I bought Beam NG Drive, which is like a kind of a physics soft body simulator kind of thing with cars and stuff. And uh, that's really fun. It's not really a game, it's more like of a physics engine, but uh, it's fucking great. You know, just crashing cars with like amazing physics is always fun, so. I've been doing that. Alright. Sub 10 minutes, let's do this. Thank you for watching. Episode 93. See you next week if I don't forget. Um, Twitter.com slash Beer and Duke. Facebook.com slash The Badcast. Live.com. I don't know if I have any emails. I didn't check. Sorry, but I'm pretty sure I don't. Uh, thank you for watching, and uh, you might see some stuff coming out. Uh, probably not. I'm saying that because I am hopeful, but I won't. So sorry. Anyways. Thank you for watching. Cheers and uh, cheers, big ears, and have a good time and uh, happy new year.